Hello and welcome to La Liga. Today it's Barcelona against Villarreal. So without further ado, we're heading for the new camp. Here's your commentary team, Martin Tyler. Wait, hold up. Hold the phone right there. Ransom using Barcelona? <laughs> What's going on, guys? It's Ransom. And uh, people who know me personally know that I normally would never use Barcelona in FIFA. This might actually be the first time I've ever used Barcelona, ever. But something happened uh, the other day during a Barcelona game that made me want to make this video and strike up a conversation and ask some questions. And uh, that is racism in sports. Now, it's been a, a hot topic lately. Everybody uh, on my Facebook wall has been talking about, you know, the whole Donald Sterling thing, him getting recorded saying some racist things, him getting banned for life. But I live in America, and in America, uh, a lot of people don't like the, the sport of soccer or football, whatever you want to call it. I don't care. I'm not your mom. I'm not going to get mad at you for saying it's something different than I do. But, uh, yeah, the, the other day, Barcelona had a game at Villarreal, and here's what happened. Danny Alves, this guy, was taking a corner kick. It sounds pretty normal, right? He was taking a corner kick. But what ended up happening is that a Villarreal fan threw a banana at him, and instead of getting you know, offended because they were calling him a monkey. He took it like a boss. He went over to the field, he picked up the banana, he unpeeled it, and ate it right there on the field. How awesome is that? Now, at the time, Barcelona were losing. They were down two to nil. And uh, I don't know if this is true, but I heard somebody, one of my friends was telling me that uh, Danny Alves in a post-game interview said that uh, he wanted to thank whoever threw the banana because it gave him the energy to help Barcelona come back and actually win the game 3-2. to two. <laughs> Now, if that is true, then that's just incredible. Hats off to Danny Alves for taking it like a boss, you know. He uh, made that racist person just feel like a dumbass. Uh, by the way, the Villarreal fan got banned for life, just like Donald Sterling. So it made me want to ask a question. Uh, do you think that the punishment fits the crime? And also, do you think that in the NBA, if this uh, were like LeBron James, one of their huge money makers being recorded saying a whole bunch of racist stuff, do you think that they would have done the same ban to him? Go ahead, leave a comment, let me know what you think. And uh, I've been Ransom. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you guys later.